I come to you from one of the most posh areas of the national capital, Greater Kailash. And here you can see there's knee-deep water. The road is submerged here. You can see how uh, difficult it is of a cars to actually move in this particular area. And if I can go a little further, you can see there's knee-deep water. And this is a situation not just here of Greater Kailash, but several other areas of the national capital where roads have been completely submerged. There's water logging. There's severe flooding because of incessant rain. It's raining cats and dogs, to say the least. And if I can go a little more further, a little further, you can see the kind, the level at which uh, there's water logging here. And this is, one, mind you, one of the most posh areas of the national capital. So you can imagine you know, the kind of collapsing infrastructure that we, must, that we are witnessing in other parts of Delhi. Now remember, today, uh, teams of the Delhi MCD, the municipal corporation, were on the ground. The mayor, um, you know, also several teams of the public works department, the irrigation department, the Jal board, all of them were there uh, on the ground taking stock of the situation. And if we talk about Delhi uh, per se, there's been over nine times, uh, you know, rainfall that's been nine times above average. And in fact, Delhi has broken all records when it comes to July. Uh, there is, uh, you know, record-breaking July rain here in the national capital, uh, in the highest in almost four decades. The last time it crossed the 160 millimeter mark was in 1982, and today we saw that, uh, you know, July uh, 8th and 9th, particularly, we saw that there was, um, you know, rainfall. Uh, almost 153 millimeter rainfall in the national capital. In fact, that was uh, record-breaking rain was recorded at uh, the Sabdar Jung Observatory of the national capital. So here you can see, in fact, the very uh, something uh, that we are witnessing across the national capital: roads submerged, waterlogged, and in fact, this is a posh area, so you will not see any uh, wires hanging here. But in other parts of the national capital, that is also a big concern, collapsing infrastructure, you know, civic apathy, because we see, uh, you know, wires hanging loose, uh, we're seeing, uh, you know, flyovers, actually, you know, cracks developing in flyovers, so that is something that's a big concern. Year after year, we witness the same thing. In fact, today we saw Atishi of uh, the Delhi government saying that, you know, all our teams on the ground, the chief minister hasn't taken his Sunday off. But the fact is, why do we witness this year after year? Uh, similar scenes in the national capital where mobility becomes a huge problem, communication becomes a huge problem as soon as monsoon hits the capital. So civic apathy is really one of the big issues. And as I report from one of the poshest areas of the national capital, you can see the situation. The Med Department has predicted that in the coming days as well, we'll be seeing similar situations across the national capital and the adjoining areas in Gurgaon, Noida as well as in Punjab and Haryana as well, uh, similar situations continue to prevail. In New Delhi with camera person Pavan Kumar Vedant for NDTV.